Okay, this is going to be a tutorial on how to send data via the serial port to the TMC470 controller. So the first thing we do is set up the controller to talk to our unit serially. So we'll go to F5, and then we'll go to F4 for properties, F3 for host. We have to set the baud, the parity, the bits, and all that to match our sending unit. We are going to use extended protocol today, and since we already have this set up, We'll just get right to it. So you see we have two lines of text, line one, line two. Line one's got some numbers, line two has got some letters. Now we're going to go over to our list here and show you what it is we need to send. The extended protocol, the first thing we need to send is the startup header. That tells the unit to expect some data. The next thing we do is to send it the message type. In this case, we use type one, which simply overwrites a line. Start of text, this tells the unit that we're going to start sending it the information. The data we're going to send, in this case, to line 1, 0, 1, always has to be two characters. And we're going to send three A's. Then we're going to send the end of text, which tells it that that's the end of the data. And then a carriage return, which is a terminator that says the message is done. The string will look like this, start of header, message type, start of text, line number, the actual data, end of text, and carriage return. Now we'll go over here to our hyper terminal, and I'm going to hit control A, and that produces this symbol, which is representative of start of header. Message type one, start of text, we're going to send the line number, then we're going to send the data, then we're going to do the end of text, and then we're going to look at that screen when I send it, and you'll see it populate with these three A's. And there you go. And then if you look back here, the response is going to be start of header, message type, this which represents an ACK or acknowledgement, the start of text, the end of text, and then this represents this character in ASCII, which is 049. So we'll send one more line, we'll send it to line two. And I'll just do this kind of quickly. Again, this is line zero two, and we'll send it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And when I send it over there, you'll see it populate, and that's pretty much all there is to it.